Hello, welcome back. Okay, so you're looking at my bed, even though it looks like a garden bench. Uh, I've just bought it from Ikea, okay, and there's a mattress, so it's not, you know, it's kind of a single bed, and, you know, ideally it will, oh, I had a bigger one, but, you know, it's gonna, the guy was just demonstrating it to me yesterday in, in another Ikea, I seem to be doing a nationwide tour of Ikeas here, maybe they'll sponsor me, that's a thought. Anyway, so the guy was going to, um, he was really helpful actually, he showed me, I had this concern that, because um, I've got to secure it to the floor, that if I, when you open it out, I'd end up facing, <laughs> the chair would end up facing the back doors. Um, but obviously that it's not the, it's not the case, it, it's fine, but the guy was really cool, he demonstrated it to me and um so yeah here i am i bought it so i did have this so i'm still in the car park the this retail park and i you can see it's been raining a little today actually quite heavily earlier so i had this crazy idea that i would just fix it up now uh, but as you can see i've got no room whatsoever and it's a little bit disconcerting that a lot of these pictures there's two people but which kind of suggests even more that I do need more space to put this up. I can't, I've got limited space here now. I mean, I could kind of move everything into the cab and stuff. But anyway, I'm not going to bother, but I'm going to wait. So what I'm going to do now, while the traffic's low, put that back in there. While there's uh, less traffic, I'm going to head to a campsite. Hopefully, I'm going to aim back... Um, where I was yeah, uh, a few days, uh, a couple of weeks ago now, the Stratford upon Avon, the race course, because there's no races on and the weather looks a bit better there and it's about an hour and a half run from here, so, and it's super, it's really nice, you know, you can really spread out there and it's going to be a little busier because it's still the holidays, but anyway, I just thought I'd show you my new bed, so that's quite exciting, it was £110, oh, oh, give up on that, it was £110, Ten pounds. Really doesn't want to <laughs> oh. uh, so yeah, the mattress was actually fifty pounds, and the frame was sixty. I could have got a nicer mattress or a firmer one, but you know that that's going to do me. I, I mean, I'm not it's not like I'm going to live in this van forever. I hope not. <laughs> Oh, okay. So yesterday, <laughs> these units I put together in like super quick time, like 10 minutes or something like that. This has taken me 10 minutes just to put those two in, <laughs> just to attach that. And it's just, you have to use both of these, to, one to hold it and one to, you know, twist it around. And... Uh, Maybe it's a two-person job, I don't know. I'm sure it'll be okay, I'm sure I'll get there, but honestly, it was, uh, I thought, when I saw how many screws there were, I thought this, is, this isn't going to take any time at all, but anyway, it's okay, I'm making progress, so I've got plenty of time, so it's all good. <laughs> all right, I'll come back a bit later if, if, if anything, if any interest happens, which is... Not likely on a IKEA furniture build, but you never know. Okay, bye. All oh, right. Honestly, I, I wonder. <laughs> I wonder if I'm actually cut out for um, DIY. And this is this is simple stuff. You can see the the obvious mistake there. That's above the bar, and that's below. I put it down. It's like, why is it so wonky? Ah. <sighs> Okay, so that's another 10 minutes. 
honestly. It didn't, the, those two didn't take me as long. I've kind of got a method sorted, but honestly, I'm just such an idiot. It's silly because I am kind of like, I like to think of myself, always worked in IT and computing and kind of got a logical mind and stuff, but sometimes I just, uh, I do wonder, maybe I'm not cut out for DIY, but we'll see. I'll keep going anyway. <laughs> Catch you later. Okay, just made another cock up. So this wheel leg is the wrong one. It's meant to be the one with the see the difference. That's got a long kind of support coming from it that hasn't. So good job I'm not like gluing this together because I'd be screwed. At least I can unscrew. <laughs> Honestly, I, I need to pay more attention to the instructions. Basically, okay, we'll get there. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> lying in my bed, lying on my bed. Oh man, that was quite an effort in the end. <sighs> Definitely long enough for me. It's like a one-person bed. God, there was a bit at the end that was a bit of a real nightmare game. Things aligned uh, in order to get the screws in. I just couldn't do it. And the bed kept, because it sprung, it's spr got a spring, it kept flick kept springing back. And I did swear, I must admit, I don't think I'm far enough away from any other campers <laughs> for them to have heard me, but... Oh man, that was quite an effort in the end, so I'm not really sure how long it took me, but... I am super excited! So there it is! My bed. I think that's going to move about a lot. <sighs> I need to attach these better under here, not really sure how to. But um sorry, you can't see under here. A bit, a bit rubbish that, but anyway, it's all good. So I'll make the bed up in a minute and then I'll I'll set up in bed I'll I'll show you the, the sofa. I am really excited, it's taken quite a lot of effort in the end. I mean it's the IKEA instructions uh God, I need a shave. The IKEA instructions are like really good actually, uh, and it's just me being a bit dumb and trying to. I tend to rush things. Uh, I've always done that, rush into things, and you know, with this kind of thing, you just have to take it slowly. So anyway, I'm gonna um, just finish this off and come back later. Okay, bye.